six stages to success. Now, what, why six? It doesn't have to be six, but it's all about moving forward gradually at whatever skill you're trying to get better at. Now, when I say skill, I mean skill within singing. So, so let's say, for example, <clears throat> if you want to look at, look at what the skills are, just go to rmbsingingalessons.com. Okay, and I go to section <clears throat> and the menu called uh, My Song Base Method. Okay, Let's see if I can get the brightness right for you. And then there, there's an image graphic for you that says all the skills. So let's say you're going to do uh, lyrics or vibrato or falsetto or blend or range or runs. Or you're going to work on um, these ones, pitch, key, rhythm, volume, pronunciation, placement. Let's say you're going to work on those skills, okay? Um, what you do is you work on them from over six stages using quarters and thirds, what I like to call. So you use this app called Amazing Slowdowner. Okay, looks like that. And here you got speed control. So with this speed control, you can set the speed between 25 and 200%. So double tap it and it goes to 100. Uh, but we're just going to work with from 25 to 100. So let's say you work on vibrato. Ooh, let's say you want to learn vibrato, yeah? So you work on it from, you can work on it the way I like to work on it, in quarters or thirds, or a combination of the two. So quarters would be, let's say the vibrato at 100%, sounds like, um, ooh, if you put it down to 25%, that would be a quarter. And then the next quarter will be 50, and then it'll be 75%, and it'll be 100. Okay, so you got those quarters. So you got 25, 50, and 75. They're the very, they're the like three speeds you're working on. And then I do thirds as well. So thirds is 33, 66, and it's not exactly a third, but it's nice to have that one more stage to work on before you get to the 100. And I do it as 88. So little bit of variation but it's nice because the numbers are sort of you know three three six six eight eight so why do I do this because if you want to get really good at a skill you gotta appreciate that it will take a long time so it can take months to years to develop a particular skill like vibrato like pitch accuracy like a very fast run so if you think about it in quarters and thirds 25, 50, 75, 100, or 33, 66, 88, or a combination of the two, 25, 33, 50, 66, 75, 88, 100. If you think about it in that way, you got six stages, 25, 33, 50, 66, 75, 88, six stages before you get to that 100 that you're trying to do. Now that's more realistic if you think of it that way, instead of thinking of it as, as in, oh, I'm trying to do this vibrato, uh, but I can't do it, uh, and it doesn't sound right, uh, uh, but I can't get fast, and uh, maybe you can do it at 25, but you can't get to the 100, and you're like, oh my god, I can't do it. Maybe there's a fast run, ooh, oh, oh, ooh, oh, oh, maybe you can do it slow, but you can't, ooh, oh, oh, but you can't get there, and you're like, oh, why, it's so fast, I can't do it. Well, be realistic and think about it in terms of quarters and thirds, six stages. If you think about it in those six stages, you feel a lot more relaxed, you feel like, oh, I've got a lot of time to achieve this. I'm just still at level one now, I'm, I'm at level 25%. Some people don't need to go that slow. Some people are kind of intermediate, advanced, and they're fine at 50. And they can do 55, 66, 75, 88, and they go to just those couple of stages. So if you think about it in those stages, you're less inclined to rush. And then when you train, you train at your level, at your stage, and you're more comfortable in your mind to train there instead of jumping too far ahead. Because if you rush too fast, you're never going to achieve it. Because you have to do it accurately before you can do it quickly, if you know what I mean. Okay, I'm Rashid Hayek, rmbsinglessons.com. See you guys next time.